Using the actual bullet-riddled bathroom door, a witness in the Oscar Pistorius murder trial reenacted the night the athlete shot and killed Reva Steenkamp. The person uh, hitting the, the door had to be had to be somewhere around here. Whether or not Pistorius was wearing his prosthetic legs that night is a big detail in this case. The evidence could corroborate his story or prove he was lying. In his initial testimony, Pistorius said he shot through the bathroom door thinking there was an intruder behind it. Then he says he put on his prosthetic legs to break down the door with a cricket bat. And that's when he discovered his girlfriend's body. But a forensic analyst in the courtroom Wednesday testified the double amputee track star was probably not wearing his prosthetic legs when he knocked down the door with a cricket bat. He got down on his knees to show the bat marks were consistent with Pistorius' height when he was on his stumps. So while this does suggest at the very least a discrepancy with what Pistorius said happened, the forensic evidence could also work in his favor. Here's how a reporter for South African TV network SABC explains it. It does uh, kind of push towards an indication that Oscar Pistorius uh, tried to exhaust at least the options that he had at that time to try and break down that door. You see, Pistorius wears his prosthetic legs most of the time. The defense will likely argue the fact that he did not have them on the night he shot Steenkamp as an indication that he did not have time to think and felt vulnerable. Pistorius is charged with murder and three gun-related offenses. If convicted on the murder charge, he'd face at least 25 years in prison. For Newsy, I'm Elizabeth Hagedorn, multiple sources, a broader view.